Mobile Security Management is an interactive intrusion platform that helps you to manage and control your business's security system remotely, anytime, from wherever you are, providing you with enhanced security management and improved productivity and control. The following instructional video will show you how to configure and use the system to best address the needs of your business. With Mobile Security Management, you can view and manage these security components on your smartphone or tablet device, motion detectors, door contacts, your alarm system keypad, and even your camera system are all part of the Mobile Security Management Network. Mobile Security Management improves your control over your security system by sending real-time text and email alerts for critical events. It also provides remote arm and disarm functionality across multiple locations with multiple users. You can also view live video to check on your business while you're away. Mobile Security Management can be accessed from any web browser, as well as a suite of mobile apps that support iPhone, Android, and BlackBerry devices. The system is fully customizable, so you can adapt it to how you run your business. From the home page, there are five modules, locations, security, users, video, and events, rules, and notifications. We'll walk through each of these modules. You can easily configure the look of these modules by simply dragging the module's title bar to the desired position. This can be done with the module either expanded or collapsed. By clicking on the plus sign, you can expand the desired view of any module. From the main screen, you can edit your login profile. Editing of profile information will be covered in more detail later in this presentation. With a single sign-on, you can manage and control up to 100 locations. You can easily add, edit, or remove locations, including uploading associated photos. You have the ability to load pictures of your facilities. You can remotely arm and disarm your alarm system by utilizing these icons. You'll be prompted for your panel code. Clicking this icon brings up the virtual keypad. From the virtual keypad, you can control system functions, including managing user codes, changing partitions, and configuring features as if you were in front of your keypad. The security module provides detailed alarm zone information. You can view information by selecting from filters on the left, such as alarms, troubles, and zones bypassed, or to just view specific zone conditions. You also have the ability to bypass a specific zone simply by clicking the zone name. The Users module provides the features and control needed to manage multiple users on the system across multiple locations. This view shows the current users associated with your account. You can easily add or edit users from this module and the ability to add a new user from this view. User groups can be created for employees, such as facility managers or shift supervisors. These groups can then be configured to receive alerts that are relevant to their position. You can enter user information, including email addresses for alert notifications, admin privileges, and photos. Grant access to specific locations and system devices, such as East Side Facility or Cameras 1 and 2. Alerts can be configured per user and sent via email or text message. SMS text is also supported to send event messages to phones and mobile devices. This module allows you to view your security system events. You can view video associated with a system event or notification. Click on Search to filter and locate archived events. You can filter specific events based on type and date of occurrence. For example, you can view all arm or disarm events or look at specific sensor or camera alerts. You determine which events will be reported to a particular user or group of users. After selecting an event type, you can configure notifications and trigger video recordings. 
When someone arms your system, you can receive an alert with an optional video clip attached that shows you who armed the system. Here, you can set a custom schedule. For each video camera on the system, you can configure notifications generated by motion and system events. You can set up multiple notifications to different users and user groups. Administrative users have the ability to configure event notifications and system rules. Notifications can be sent when these types of changes are made. In the video module, you can view live video with up to six cameras per location. Recorded video clips can also be reviewed. By clicking on an individual camera's thumbnail image, you can view the real-time live video. You can control the pan and tilt functions of a camera using the arrow buttons. Use the home button to move the camera to its home position. Four presets quickly move the camera to a predetermined area. When this icon is clicked, you can manually capture a 10-second video clip. The video clip will be stored as an event and may trigger an email notification if desired. For each camera connected to your system, you can configure various parameters for the specific situation or scenario. Configuring video camera parameters is easy. For each camera, you can define the attachment type format as well as the pre- and post-capture duration of each video clip. This gives you enhanced control for each camera based on the potential scenarios. For example, you can configure for each camera to record 2 seconds before the event occurred and 8 seconds afterwards, or 5 seconds before and 5 seconds after, depending on the situation and camera purpose. Each camera can have a different configuration. These parameters will then dictate the format and details of the clips stored on the system and those that are emailed as alert events. Choose the triggered input that will capture video. Input selection is triggered by the security system's control panel. Such a trigger may come from a backdoor opening or a vault door opening. PIR selection is triggered by the camera's PIR sensor. Events are triggered on movement within the PIR sensor view. There are no masking, sensitivity levels, or adjustments. Motion selection is triggered by video analytics within four user-defined event detection areas. To further define your alert parameters, you can configure event detection areas which define where the system looks for motion. The sensitivity of each zone can also be adjusted so you only get notified when a real incident occurs. You can drag and resize the box as desired. Motion detected in any area will trigger a video event and store a video clip or series of snapshots. For more information about mobile security management, visit www.tycoismobilesecurity.com or call 1-800-289-2647.